Thanks for letting me see him, Rory. Clyde. Did you hurt Lily? Because if you touched one single hair on her head, I swear I'll kill you. Lily's my friend. My best friend. Wait up, Clive. Lily's gone. Clive, and some say you might know something about it. I need to find my daddy. You'll fit right in. No brains at all. Very funny. I can't believe you. You were sleeping all night. Yeah, but not quality sleep. The bed was always rocking. Tell me who you see. It looks like Jack! Guess you didn't kill him either. Well now what are we gonna do? Hurry, Gordy, and tie us. journal. I did not. I put a marker in it so I'd know if you touched it. It would almost fall into water. I saved it. It opened accidentally. Journals are private for me. So you'd rather be alone, huh? You did read it, jerk. Then why didn't you just tell me you didn't want me here in the first place? I never asked you to come. reminds me of something in the book. A scow went by so close that we could hear them laughing and cussing and talking, heard them playing, but we ain't seen no sign of them. Jim said it was spirits, but I says no. Spirits wouldn't say they're in the darn fog. Weird. You know it's our fourth night now. So? If I'm not back by tomorrow, my parents will start worrying. My, my uncle lives in Waterbridge, just down the stream. Maybe you should think about going back too. At least you have a home to go back to. You thought it was bad for me before. Can you imagine what it's going to be like now? Just think a detective might be able to help find your dad better. 
Look, Brody, if you want to go home, you can. But I have to find my father. That was the whole point of this voyage. Shh! Did you hear that? No. I can't see a damn thing in this fog. Maybe it's Jack. I don't think so. Get in the water. something out there. Bigfoot! Uh, hey, what's going on? What did you do that for? It's a freaking shit! That's a villain! Oh! with you. Are you ready to go? I need a minute with Willie. 